Tonight, another New York City daycare is the focus of an investigation into dangerous criminal activity. Police say they discovered a ghost gun printing operation inside a daycare in East Harlem. The bust comes less than two weeks after the death of a one-year-old boy inside a center suspected of being a front for a fentanyl drug ring. CBS's Adrika Duncan has the new details. New York City police say they arrested an 18-year-old and two minors who allegedly used a home-based daycare center in this apartment building in Harlem as a ghost gun lab. You got an 18-year-old in his room, 3D printer. He's not making little robotic toys. He's making guns. Investigators seized two printed pistols, a printed assault rifle, and an incomplete handgun, all found in an unlocked room inside the daycare. This is a heartbreaking scenario of thinking that you're dropping your child off to a place of safe haven just to find out uh, that it was a dangerous environment. The suspects are facing multiple charges, including illegal firearms possession and the manufacturing of an assault weapon. The 18-year-old's mother ran the daycare since 2021. It was last inspected by the city in February. This investigation comes nearly two weeks after a one-year-old boy died and three other children were hospitalized when they were exposed to fentanyl residue inside a daycare center in the Bronx. Yesterday, the owner's husband was picked up by police in Mexico. Officials now say they will review training practices when it comes to inspecting daycares. Who would have thought that we must add uh, to our list of inspections of do we have 3D printers that can print guns? CBS News has learned the daycare was licensed to have 12 children as young as six weeks old. When asked if the mother of the suspect who ran that daycare would face any charges, authorities would only say that the investigation is ongoing. Nora? Tarika Duncan, thank you very much.